your card right now? No, I don't want it refunded. I'm here to pick it up. Yeah, this is just, I am, I am flabbergasted. You'd be disrespectful of a customer picking up an order. Mr. Wood, all we ask is that you leave that outside. That's it. Yeah. That's it. And then you started down this whole... It's just stupid. I'm, I'm not, I, I agree. And I think it's prejudiced, too. About what? Because you're white? Because I'm poor. I'm poor, too. I work in a fucking bike shop. How do you, how would you see that as prejudice? You gotta be kidding me. I don't know your social status of anything. I'm an outdoorsman. I've got five backpacks like that. I love them. That's why I, I was saying that earlier about the, it's, that's your market. I don't know if you're grocery shopping or what you're doing. I don't care. All I know is that we're not allowed to have big, huge backpacks in the store. That's Ralph's, that's any shopping place. That's kind of No, it's not. I live like this and I... I, that's I fine. It, it's discriminatory to say one person can have a bag and a woman can have You can have a hers. purse, but you can't have a humongous backpack because theft is another thing. I don't think you're going to steal. We have kids that do. So it's common when kids come in with their backpacks, you say, kids, if you don't mind, leave your backpacks outside. So we do that to everyone. We don't just do it to you. Yeah, okay. And we got on this whole track down that. I just feel like I'm being singled out for being poor. It's from a scientific standpoint, it's ridiculous. It's the person that's the problem. Well, the per the people are there's a virus, yeah, I'm aware. But that's me and I'm wearing the mask and for all I know you're making excuses because you don't want the poor person around. You gotta be kidding me. That's lame. Yeah, look at it from me. You're a ritzy shop and you're I'm the one that knows scientifically that's that's wrong so how would i know if you're poor or rich or what got a very large backpack that you how do i know you're not doing like weightlifting or something with it no i do that land? too i'd actually do that too well, that's what i mean so why would i pass judgment yeah by the way you said you had a couple like that do you because you would know that's that extremely yeah. expensive that's a proper international i got dana designs and mystery ranches yeah. proper international marine corps pack that's eight ninety nine yeah. just for the base pack plus all the Molly gear and the hip belt yeah, and all that. Yeah, a thousand bucks just for the frame. Mm, an ultralight. This was you've not ultralight. You've never seen these guys? No. They used to be called Dana Designs. They do hand-built ones in Montana and then they sold.